Life is like riding a bicycle. To keep your balance, you must keep moving. Where the world ceases to be the scene of our personal hopes and wishes, where we face it as free beings admiring, asking, observing, there we enter the realm of art and science. All religions, arts, and sciences are branches of the same tree. I believe in one thing, that only a life lived for others is a life worth living. The important thing is to not stop questioning. Curiosity has its own reason for existing. Look deep into nature, and then you will understand everything better. He who can no longer pause to wonder and stand wrapped in awe, is as good as dead, his eyes are closed. I believe in standardizing automobiles. I do not believe in standardizing human beings. I believe in intuitions and inspirations. I sometimes feel that I am right. I do not know that I am. I am by heritage a Jew, by citizenship a Swiss, and by makeup a human being, and only a human being without any special attachment to any state or national entity whatsoever. I speak to everyone in the same way, whether he is the garbage man or the president of the university. Imagination is more important than knowledge. Knowledge is limited. Imagination encircles the world. We cannot solve our problems with the same thinking we used when we created them. I am enough of an artist to draw freely upon my imagination. Imagination is more important than knowledge. Knowledge is limited. Imagination encircles the world. My passion for social justice has often brought me into conflict with people, as has my aversion to any obligation and dependence I did not regard as absolutely necessary. Try not to become a man of success, but rather try to become a man of value. It occurred to me by intuition, and music was the driving force behind that intuition. My discovery was the result of musical perception. One thing I have learned in a long life, that all our science, measured against reality, is primitive and childlike, and yet it is the most precious thing we have. Great spirits have always encountered violent opposition from mediocre minds. Anyone who has never made a mistake has never tried anything new. There are only two ways to live your life. One is as though nothing is a miracle. The other is as though everything is a miracle. Try not to become a man of success. Rather become a man of value. The most beautiful experience we can have is the mysterious. It is the fundamental emotion that stands at the cradle of true art and true science. Whoever is careless with the truth in small matters cannot be trusted with important matters. The world is a dangerous place to live, not because of the people who are evil, but because of the people who don't do anything about it. The pursuit of truth and beauty is a sphere of activity in which we are permitted to remain children all our lives. Once you can accept the universe's matter expanding into nothing that is something, wearing stripes with plaid comes easy. Genius is 1% talent and 99% hard work. Imagination is everything. It is the preview of life's coming attractions. The world as we have created it is a process of our thinking. It cannot be changed without changing our thinking. When you trip over love, it is easy to get up. But when you fall in love, it is impossible to stand again. Two things are infinite, the universe and human stupidity. And I'm not sure about the universe. When you are courting a nice girl an hour seems like a second. When you sit on a red hot cinder a second seems like an hour. That's relativity. I speak to everyone in the same way, whether he is the garbage man or the president of the university. A human being is a part of the whole called by us universe, a part limited in time and space. He experiences himself, his thoughts and feeling as something separated from the rest, a kind of optical delusion of his consciousness. This delusion is a kind of prison for us, restricting us to our personal desires and to affection for a few persons nearest to us. Our task must be to free ourselves from this prison by widening our circle of compassion to embrace all living creatures and the whole of nature in its beauty. If I were not a physicist, I would probably be a musician. I often think in music. I live my daydreams in music. I see my life in terms of music. The important thing is not to stop questioning. Curiosity has its own reason for existence. One cannot help but be in awe when he contemplates the mysteries of eternity, of life, of the marvelous structure of reality. It is enough if one tries merely to comprehend a little of this mystery each day.